If you're looking for the ultimate Zendrop tutorial, this video is for you. In this video, I'm going to show you exactly how to use Zendrop for your dropshipping product fulfillment. It is by far one of my favorite dropshipping tools, and I'll show you what it is, how to sign up, how to import and sell up products, and yeah, basically just how to start selling today. This tutorial is going to take you step by step from A to Z, so watch until the end and you'll be an expert at Zendrop. Let's get started. So the number one question I get when it comes to dropshipping is how do you actually fulfill orders? Like how do you find products to sell that sell well, but then also how do you actually ship these products to the customer? So Zendrop basically does all this for you. They have a huge product catalog and once you connect it to your Shopify store, it's going to allow you to import these products into your store and will source, ship, and fulfill when order is placed. A really cool thing is that a lot of these products, they come from their US warehouse, meaning you get much, much faster shipping. So now let's talk about how you guys can actually get Zendrop. If you click on my exclusive link below, you'll get access to a seven day free trial plus a 50% discount for three months. And yeah, this is going to let you try the Zendrop Plus plan, which comes with all the features that I'm going to show you in this video. So all you need to do is fill out your name, your email, click on next, enter in your card number and click start free trial. You can cancel at any time or just downgrade to the free plan, but I'm pretty positive that you'll get a ton of value from the Zendrop Plus plan. So once you sign up for Zendrop, it's going to take you to this dashboard. And the first thing you're going to want to do is actually connect it to our Shopify store. You won't need to do this if you use the AI store builder, but if you already had a Shopify store or you sign up for Zendrop directly with my link, you're going to first need to connect your Shopify store to your Zendrop account. I've already built a store, so I'm going to click on this one right here. We'll click on continue. And yes, Zendrop also works with other platforms. You can choose something else besides Shopify, but I think 99% of you watching this are probably going to use Shopify. So now it's going to show you exactly how to integrate your store with Zendrop. So basically you just go through these directions. It's very, very easy, but I'm going to show you guys exactly how to do it right here. So what we're going to do is click on this authorize button. Now we're going to click on install right here. If you're already logged into your Shopify account, it's going to pop up like this. And now what we're going to do is click on install. So you can answer some of these questions if you want, or you can just skip it. I'm going to click on pet supplies, click continue. It's going to show us some of their favorite products. So what we can do is automatically add some of these. These come pre-selected. So let's say there are some that I don't want to sell. Like let's say this one, we'll click on this trash can to remove it. And so now we have 10 products selected and we're going to click publish to store. Of course, you can do this later, but that's just going to pre-populate your store with some of these products. Okay. So now you're in your Zendrop app dashboard. And let me show you guys how this works. So right now we have our Yorkie's best site connected already. The cool thing is you can actually have multiple stores on one Zendrop account. So that's gonna save you a ton of money. But for now, I'm gonna leave it on this Yorkie's best site. Here, it's gonna show you your revenue. So you can change how long you want this for. I just made this store brand new, so there's no information. But we can sort by time period and also by country of sale. And we can also export all this information too. Here's going to show you your unfulfilled orders you can easily click fulfill all. And then over here, you can see there's this private agent tab. This essentially lets you get custom quotes for different products, and it's going to unlock once you reach 20 orders. Now, if I come here to the find products tab, this is basically where we can find any product that we want to sell. So what I recommend doing is searching by the title of the product. You can also sort by different categories by the price range. You can select where you want to ship from. So for example, if you want really fast shipping, Shipping, you might want to just select US only. And you can also sort by suppliers. We can also browse all the different products by just scrolling down here, getting some inspiration. Now, let me search up small dog collar. Let's say I want it to ship from the US only. I'm going to see a bunch of different results that satisfy those requirements. But let's say that we want to check out this product right here. If we click on it, we can learn more about it. We can see the supplier. It's going to also show you the processing time. We'll get some more information about this product. Product. For example, the order trend score basically shows the order volume, how it's changed over the last 30 days. So this one has actually been ordered a lot more. You also have saturation, you have orders by countries, and also shows related products. But essentially, let's say I want to choose this product right here. What I'm going to do is click on add to my products. You can also order a sample too. That's very important to test the quality. And this is basically how you review and publish an item to your store. So you're going to select the language and I'm just going to leave it as English. You can change change the product name if you wish. You can add any product tags. This is going to be maybe helpful for a site with a ton of different products. This stuff you don't need to do, but it's up to you. You're going to come here to description. And here, what I would do is basically copy this, put it into chat GPT, tell it to make you a better description. You can also press this button right here. That's basically going to use AI directly within Zendrop to redo this description. Really cool. You can change the variance, of course. Here's where we can change the sales price. So let's say I want to make this
this $39.99. That's gonna show us our profit right here. Images, we just have this one product image right now. And once this is all done, you're gonna click on publish to my store. And now if we come here to my products, come here to store listings and sourcing, and you can see we have those 10 products that we initially imported into our account, as well as this one that we just added right here. It's gonna show you the number of sales in the last seven days. It's gonna show you the connection status. So these are all linked, which means they are live on the website. And then at any time we can click into the product. It gets us back to this main dashboard where we can get some more information about it. If there are any issues with some of your products, it's gonna show up in this section right here. And this is very important for you guys to do because you definitely do not want any fulfillment issues. So when someone makes an order on your actual site, this is where it's gonna show up. It's gonna be in the orders tab right here. And what you guys can do here is we can sort by different numbers of days. We can also export this list too. Of course, I don't have any orders here since this is a brand new store. But what I recommend doing is turning on auto fulfillment. It's going to fulfill any orders automatically without your approval. You don't need to manually sort through these and approve them. It's just gonna do it automatically. And we can set it to do it instantly. So that's basically every 10 minutes. There's daily. So this does it at 7 p.m. Eastern time. We can set a 24 hour delay. And yeah, I'm just gonna leave that as instantly for now. If you choose to approve them manually, you can come here and click on fulfill all. And that's just gonna fulfill all the current active orders. Now, right now I don't have any credit in this account, so we can't actually make these orders. What you're gonna want to do is actually top up your balance. And to do that, you're gonna come here to top up, click on credit card or PayPal. And that's how you add money to your account. So now let's go over the extras. So branding right here is very, very important. What you're going to want to do is turn this on. But before you turn it on, you're going to need to design your thank you card. So what I recommend doing is add a logo for your company, put some type of title, let's say something like thank you, put in our address, an email, and then click on save. So that's just the classic way. What I actually recommend doing is come here to custom. And what I would do is go to Canva, create a custom thank you card, make it have some design some better colors and stuff like that. It should be about 1200 by 840 pixels. And then you're gonna upload that right here. So that just looks a lot better. But for now, I'm just gonna have this. We're gonna turn branding on. And this is automatically gonna be printed and sent within all of your orders. So that's a really great thing about Zendrop. Most fulfillment companies do not do this. It puts a very personal touch that dropshipping desperately needs, and it really does help with customer satisfaction. Now, if you're trying to sell a particular product and you can't find it within Zendrop, you can actually request a product. So essentially what you're gonna do is come here, put a link to the product listing, enter in how many units you are selling or plan to sell, and then click on this request button. Essentially what they're gonna do is they're gonna go talk to all their different suppliers, manufacturers, and they're gonna source this product and potentially add it to their catalogs so that you can sell it. If you're selling more than 20 units per day for a particular product, I definitely recommend using this right here to get a custom quote. And here it's going to show you your product request history. Now trending products, I haven't covered this yet, but basically if you want a really cool place to just see a ton of trending products that are selling well right now, this is where you're going to go and find inspiration. Since Zendrop is a supplier, they have all the data in the world. And so they really know what is selling and what is not. This is a great place to get inspiration for any new products you might want to add to your store. And the same thing, if you click on the product, you can see see all this information, the product cost, average shipping time, and then you can add it to your products. Now, Zendrop Academy is one of the best parts about the Zendrop Plus plan. If you guys are on the free plan of Zendrop, you should really consider signing up just to get this. But essentially, it's a whole mentorship, a whole course. And yeah, I know there's a ton of value on YouTube. There's tons of videos out there, but this is a great place to have everything in organized modules. They also have live coaching sessions, which are fantastic. And you get access to their community, right? One of the worst parts about entrepreneurship is building alone. So if you can find like-minded people who have a similar goal, similar business, talking to them, masterminding with them is going to add so much value to your business. So I definitely recommend no matter if you're a beginner or intermediate or advanced, you can absolutely get value from their courses. And this comes included with the plus plan. Now Zendrop AI is also a cool new feature. You can basically use it to create ad copy. So it's very similar to ChatGPT. It's a bit more defined and the parameters are a little 
little bit better for e-commerce. And you can also chat with the expert bot, which can help answer your e-commerce dropshipping questions. Now, alongside dropshipping, there's also print on demand with Zendrop. So if I come here, you can see, yes, you can sell already made products with Zendrop, but you can also do print on demand. So let's say you want to create merch or t-shirts, anything that has your logo or design on it. You can come here and basically source the product and have it printed on demand when someone purchases it. For example, if I want to do this hat, we'll click on start design. You're going to upload your design or logo or whatever right here. You can also add text, add different files, whatever. I'm just going to say text. We'll click on create product. It's going to process. And now we're going to be able to sell this directly on our Shopify site. You'll be able to set your price, see the profit margin. And this is a very quick way to start selling your own customized clothing and merch. So that's basically how you use Zendrop. I know we covered a lot of information, but feel free to reference back to this video at any point. Again, I'll have links to the AI store builder if you want to get a free AI built store. I'll have my link directly to Zendrop if you want to get a free trial of their Zendrop Plus plan. You'll get a bunch of free order credits and a 50% discount for, I believe, the first three months. So that's really cool. And yeah, hopefully you got a ton of value from this video. If you're embarking on your dropshipping journey and you are looking for a really reliable product fulfillment supplier, then yeah, Zendrop is a fantastic choice. If you got any value from the video, please consider giving it a like, commenting, and also subscribing if you want to see more content just like this. I do a ton of videos about business, finance, basically stuff that helps you live a financially successful life. That's my main goal. Thank you so much for your time and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.